Licking Referrers, welcome back to the Licking Room. Today we're gonna learn Don't Look Back in Anger. So put on a C chord, just a run of the mill C chord, and you start with the open E string, then you play the chord with it any way you want. Open E string, 3 3 1 on the second string, can pull it off. Okay, you can pull it off. And then you have G with 3 1 on the second string. Open E string. And then A minor with 3 1 on the second string, and then 2 on the third. Okay, you can pull it off again. Then you have the open E string again, and then you go to E7 with 3 on the 2nd string. It's an E chord with 3 on the 2nd string, and I play strings 2 and 3 together just for the harmony, okay, with the bass of course, and then 1 on the 2nd string. So I just do this little mini bar here on the 2nd string. Okay, so I still have the 3rd string, okay, on 1, okay, so both of them are on one. Open E string again. And then you have F with three one on the second string, two on the third. So there you can use your thumb for one on the bass. Hey, I, it's not absolutely necessary. And then you have G, you just play the bass. And then you have one one zero on the second string. Okay, you can pull it off, and then one again with C. And the open third string. Then you play G. Any way you want to pick it. So that's your verse. C, G, A minor. You see, I'm not pulling off. Sounds just as good. And then E7, F, G, C, and then G, you play this twice, and then you have the pre-chorus. It's uh, F again, with 3-3-1 three, three, on the second string, so it's bass first, and then you have F minor, so it's a bar on one, okay, it's a bar on one, so now you have one on the third string instead of two. With 3-1-3-1 three, one, three, one on the second string, so it's important to pick the third string. And then C with the open third string, and then you do it again. Okay, F minor. G with three ones on the second string. Okay, three, one, three, one, three, one, three. And then you have this. It's E over G. It's uh, five and four on strings two and three with four on the bass. You can do it with your thumb. Okay, and then you have three, three on the second string, five on the third, three, five on the second, five on the third. So the thumb is actually more convenient in this case. Okay, so. Okay, it's just a lot more convenient than putting these fingers on. Okay, like this. Okay, it's. Okay, it's a lot more convenient. Um, okay, we're here on five on the third string, then A minor, E string. And then 3-3-1 three, three, on the second string, and then G with 3-1-3. Three, three. Open E string, F. Strings 2-3-2. Two, two. It's all in the chord. Okay, you play the chord, you have space, and then G. The third string is the, is the melody note, but you can play anything you want, basically. See? Works. Chorus. C with three on the first string. Then you have G with one, three, one, zero. 
And then you have A from A minor, so. Okay, the bass comes first, so that's what's in the tab. You can play the chord any way you want. And then you have E7, strings 2, 1, 2. F. Second string is the melody note. G. 3, 1, 3 on the second string, open first. And then you have C, second string, third string. G. And then you have C again. G with 1, 3. And then you have A minor, open E string, and then you have this. Okay? Um, it's E7 again, D shape, okay? D7 on the fourth fret. That's the logic here. It's an E7 chord so because D7, D sharp 7. E7. Um, and you play the, the sixth ring with it, of course, and you start with five on the first. And then you just pick it again, the whole chord, and then the open E string. So you can pull off to it. Okay, so it's... Now the bass comes first. So you have time to move. Okay, you have time to put on the chord. And then you have F again with three zero on the first, three on the second, one on the second, G bass, because it's okay, like this. And then one one hammer on to three on the second string, open E string, and then one again on the second. back to C. So once again, the chorus, C, G, A minor, E7, F, G, C, G, C again, G, A minor, this chord, E7, okay, and then F, G, C. You can download the tab for free. The link is below in the description. The tabs are always free on Lick and Ref. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And check out the shorts. Check out the shorts. A new awesome guitar tip every single day. Okay, so check out the shorts. Uh, invite your friends. Share. Share with them. Um, it's all about the love of music. See you next lesson. Bye for now. Thanks for watching.